Hello, how are you all doing everybody? Um, not been doing much lately, um, any reviews or nothing, just want a little break. Um, got plenty of other stuff to do at the moment, so a lot of work going on, um, a lot of other things as well. And uh, yeah, I'm uh, also trying to get back my fitness again, because I'm doing the Berlin Marathon next year. So yeah, I'm trying to gradually build my fitness up. I want to get to about 80% fitness before I do the initial four month training plan for the marathon. It's not going to be easy, but I can't bloody wait. And uh, yeah, I did the marathon last year in London. Not done much this year at all. Um, so it'll be nice to get back and see the, the lads again. Um, so yeah, I won't be doing as much content as usual. But I will try to get the odd thing out here and there. And I will also try to comment on uh, the tubers I know. And you know who you are. So yeah, I've been in the loft anyway uh, this afternoon. And I found something which I haven't seen for quite a while. And... Uh, brought in the shed to show you because the missus isn't very happy having it in the loft surprise surprise anyway hold on and you'll see what it is here's me coming to Omega 500 and I uh, got this back in 91 and 92 I'm not sure which year it was but I remember going to the shop my mate Peter, uh, he was working there at the time. I went with my brother, and I remember seeing um, Mega Drive. And as soon as he went in the shop, he seen a CRT with Sonic belting all over the screen. And uh, I had tested it out for a couple of months with one of my mates, and I was going to get one. And then my mate said, Look, I've got something in the back of the shop, I'll show you. So I went in the back of the shop, and he says, Look, get one of these. It's coming on Amiga 500. You can do so much with it, and uh, the games are absolutely class. And I was like, uh, wasn't sure. But anyway, when I got it, I was absolutely over the moon, over the moon, and so glad I got this and made that decision. Anyway, let's have a look at it in the box. So, let's see what we've got in here. That's the, it's the modulator, I think. It goes in the back of the actual computer. Get rid of that. Yeah, anyone remember that? God, honestly. It's been so long since I've seen this. <laughs> and there it is there. Oh, give us a second while I get out of the package. So here it is. Me Amiga. Oh, what a computer this was. Absolutely loved it back in the day. Such a shame it doesn't work anymore. Um, as I say, I would love to get it back. I will one day, I'm sure of it. Still in pretty good nick as well. Oh, apart from not working, it's uh, condition wise pretty good. Let's have see all the sockets. Oh, modulator goes in, TV. Um, also your joystick ports I put on the side there uh, that's where the discs go oh, I miss this I miss this so much uh, anyway also, also got in the box I've got one mouse here and um, this is not the original mouse I think this was a uh, I just bought this separately I think this is the original mouse here. Get the wires off. Yeah, remember that? Not much of a click there, but it is pressing down. Yeah, so that was the two mice I got with it. Obviously, uh, 
leaves to connect it. It's the power pack. Yeah. And uh, I bought this uh, to link it up the TV. Obviously, it just goes back on the uh, just goes back on the computer. And it's a start lead goes on the TV. So I got that from Retro Computers. Uh, Retro Computer Shack. A few moments later. So that's my Commodore Amiga for you. I just thought I'd show you. Obviously, got out the loft and I uh, just wanted to just have a look at it again and show you that I've actually got a Commodore Amiga. <laughs> it just doesn't work, but um. Yeah, I'm hoping to get this up and running, I would say maybe next year if possible. Anyway, tune in because I'm going to do a top 10 of my favourite Commodore Amiga games. And uh can't wait to show you that. I'll probably be doing that on an emulator, but hey, I'm showing my favourite games I used to play back in the day. As I say, it's a top 10, but it's not in any particular order. It's just some of the favourites I used to play back in the day. So that's it everybody, um, thanks for watching and uh, I do appreciate you subscribe to the channel and uh, take care everyone, see you all very soon and goodbye.